this is the deluxe room guys get in here before Nina um, destroys the place thought that was a mirror then it's not it's a big window a big pervy window into the bathtub Wow and at the moment 750,000 kip which is only about 75 US dollars at the moment if you can get into Lao at the moment which there are ways you can what they bargain We'll go now if you want. Yeah. Just, just going to take us through to the VIP room. Let us check the VIP room out. Just, just to check it out. Welcome to my room. Your room. <laughs> <laughs> you throw us down in the dodgy yeah. deluxe. Okay, this at the moment is um, five million. Five million kip, which is about 500 US dollars. Check out that day bed and the view. Everyone's happy with this. She's going to have trouble getting us out. We all could have just pitched in and just all stayed in this room. All of us. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. All of us got our own pool. Yeah. Okay. From 75, which was ours, to 500 US dollars. Similar sort of rooms, a lot bigger this. You're paying for the day bed and the pool, aren't you? Oh yeah, and your own private courtyard. <laughs> okay, got Jay. Yeah, How's you. that for service? How was your room? Very good. They're very, very happy with it. I just got the drone up too. Very beautiful from the air. This place. No lie. <laughs> got a shotgun.
Okay, in at the one for bar. I know it's early, it's only a bit after 10 o'clock, but this restaurant here is a Camus restaurant. We've stopped here for lunch. Gonna have a bit of a walk around, look around. And um, they're gonna cook us up a feast. But we are just south of the main street of Luangkaba. Well, this is actually the main street. It is the way you come into town. You drive into this way, continue on, and then straight into the night market section up there. Australian steak? Yes. I'll try that. Okay, but they, you know, they don't write the way we, they support the way, but... Beef steak Australia, uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> nice place, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, looks like we're heading upstairs. Yeah, ah oh, yeah, yeah. Getting rid of all the husk and that off it, yeah. Clean it out. You often see things similar to that now at the markets, they just got it stacked up with fruit and veg. <laughs> oh, she's going to go up in flames then, the whole dress. Don't burn me chips. <laughs> hey, that steak looks alright. Hello, Sabadi. Pleased to meet you. This is my sister-in-law. Okay. This is my cousin-in-law, her husband is my cousin. Ah, okay. Nice to meet you. He's that's her name. name. What's short name? La? Bun. 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 Todd. Todd is short. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice Luang Pabang sausage there, isn't yes. it? Yeah. There's going to be more food coming up. So. How good does this look? Oh. You're going to make me fat. How good does that food look? What a feed. That is seriously good taka. And it's not too far from the hotel we're staying in. Now it's both on the, um, pretty sure it's the southern side of the Wang Thabang. So would be a great restaurant to come to if you are staying at the Luang Thabang, the Luang Thabang View Hotel. Be a great bloody restaurant to come to wherever you're staying in the Wang Um It's Kat's sister-in-law, cousin-in-law, something like that. And we're just about to go out to... She runs this Camus 2 restaurant. And they've also got a hotel resort further up the river on the other side of town. Uh, and the husband's there. She's here, the husband's running this other business. So we're gonna go out and have a look at that this afternoon. Don't know if it'll be in this vid. If not, it'll be in the next one. But I'm uh, gonna have a chat to her and see how long they've been here. And what a popular Camus Mert dish is. I'm pretty sure it's not an Australian steak and pizza and garlic bread and those cheese things they were feeding me up there but it wasn't just me you see the others got steaks and things like that too she just wanted to show that this is a great restaurant for foreigners traveling here yeah 
and serving up great traditional Kamu meals also. Who said they can't eat Kamu meals? Just ask and burn about the scene in photos of traditional Kamu cooking. They cook up like large stews and soups in a buffalo skin. It's pegs in the ground and their skin is stretched out. I'll see if I can dig a photo up for you so you know what I'm talking about. And I commented to Nina, you'd think, it, you know, the fire underneath it would just burn through the buffalo skin. They're using the buffalo skin like a pot, you know, to cook this broth to stew up in. So I'm just asking how many, how long it would last. Did we get an answer? Uh, no, they, they don't keep it. They don't, they don't keep, keep it. It's just for one, just for, just for one cook, cook, is yes. it? Okay, yeah. yeah. Well, of course it wouldn't yeah, be. So I, I thought like, you, it must have been used again. a few times. No, yeah. Because it yeah. would eventually burn a hole in it. Okay. Okay. That answers that. Yeah. You know, both me and Nini thought it was just something that was reused over and over. But yeah, you just get one cook out of it. But you're getting all the flavour and that from the skin into the broth. What are they cooking inside it? Is it like a broth? A เห็ดอาหารเนี่ยได้ใส่อยู่ในอ๋อก็จะออกประเภทเพียร yeah. Everything that the inside of that stomach go in there. Nothing goes to waste, does it? No. <laughs> How long has Boon had this restaurant? How long has it been here? Oh, this is her second one. She have the first one over there at Night Market. Yeah. So right now she's like 16 years, right? Yeah. Okay. And you are Kamu? Yeah. You are, yeah. What is a popular Kamu dish that everybody would know? Oh, uh, lamb. Uh, lamb. Uh, lamb. <laughs> <laughs> Lamb. Lamb, lamb is lamb. popular. And okay. And squirrel too. And squirrel. Yes. Yeah. So that's her. This is her most famous dish. It's not really like soupy, like you, it's you know. It's more thicker, really like thick, a stew. Thicker, yes. Yeah. 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 Put more sticky rice in it. Yeah. Make it thicker, and then it less witchy in it. Uh, oh. I'm more of a stew person oh. than a oh. soup person. I don't mm -hmm. like real watery soups and things like that. I prefer. Oh, like prefer yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So then, uh, you know, she uh, she come in and start working a little bit and have some money and then she start Kamu Spa. Mm. That's how it start first. Uh, Kamu Spa and she gets save some up and then open enough to open a small restaurant and she hired all Kamu just yeah just Kamu Kamu who needed work yeah and help them so some of them come into the city to go to school and everything because they are from outside yeah, you know, yeah. countryside so this helped them to make extra money yeah school and everything. Uh, very good yeah yeah so, this is how it's so the staff all the staff here are Kamu the yes the young lady that was serving on us and that, yeah. That's great. <laughs> All this is original. Just found out. It's 198 year old. 1824. This place is built. That's not original. But, but this one is. Sorry, Nini. Two hundred year old. One year, one year, one year. They had lots of posts. Okay. Okay, but this was an original. Yes, this, so yeah. Original. And all yeah. this timber on the walls. Yeah, this, this part right here. 
there's a pot. But you know, when you go there, they have to replace that one. Yeah, but this. Oh, the new one. Yeah. The new one. That's yeah. new, but you can uh, yeah. see the difference, yeah. yeah. That's yeah. original. Cool guy. On tour. On tour. On tour. Oh, we're getting into the real shit here, yeah. Real, real original one. It's the same thing like this upstairs. Yeah. There's too many of them. It's hard for them to go. Right. Okay. Yeah. Took them out. You turn. 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 It's, it's, it's like into the end. Okay. The whole wall like that. So that's was like, like this. Yes. So yeah, you can see them up there yes. where they uh -huh. would have been. Uh -huh. And they've cut them out. Would have been yeah. there. Yeah. yeah. Just to make space more space. Yeah. 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 Y
Any of you climbers thinking this would be a great abseil and place? No, you can see how brittle the rock is here. There's fresh scars in it where it's tumbled down into the water. Would be ideal that, wouldn't it? <laughs> the old fellas are uh, explaining to us how these got the how this area got its name. Apparently, these two big rocks are the wings of a giant bird and it was killing people and the elder the mayor put the word out for somebody to come if they could come and kill it and they would get the hand of the mayor's daughter and it's the rest of the story is going to be translated to me later he just went on and on but apparently they they shot it with arrows this guy he had a name and everything uh, more to come about that story but while we still got light because we're about to go on the boat i just thought we'd um have a quick sticky i hope nobody's renting these of these bungalows you're looking about five dollars uh, eighty thousand okay Tonight, yeah. you're looking about eight dollars there you go mm -hmm. that's all right Uh, and looking straight out at the, at the big bird, at the big bird. I'm sitting there, he's telling a story about a big bird, and all I could see in the rock face was an elephant. So lots to do out here. Um, you can go on boat tours and good swimming area and kayaks and canoes and take little long boats across to the jumping off the rocks and great place just to get away for a weekend with your mates and a few couples and just to escape hey good day mate yeah. cheers mate <laughs> hey yeah. That's my new australian mate uh, yeah. awesome yeah. lovely spot <laughs> he's a tall guy right yeah you, i 20, just asked him 22 year experience no oh. whole country the whole Thank country. Yeah. I work for uh, Permanent with uh, Lao Yut Travel in Luang Prabang. Okay. Mm. What's your favorite place in Lao? Uh, my homeland. <laughs> my homeland. Where, where's Savannakit. Savannakit. Yes. Okay. Oh. At least yeah. I see grandma. But here is one of the lovely. This is beautiful. Story. Yeah. Yeah. yeah we've... Gorgeous. Ooh, amazing. You've been down to the islands, Sipan, Sipandon? Never, but I live. I used to live in Paxi for three years. Okay. Uh, driving. Car right. Yeah. Since nineteen ninety-seven. Oh, very nice good. You. Thank you, man. Gentleman's name is Man. M U E N. M U E N. Man. Moon. 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 Yes. Moon. That was it. Man is potato. <laughs> <laughs> oh, one more time. You. Are always welcome to visit Pa and Nice View, Luang Prabang. Yeah, magic view. Employ hardship. See you guys then. See you, man. Okay. 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 Okay.
I was trying to work out what the purpose of this shaped kayak boat is. I think I've got it. So you can climb back in the bastard easier. You just have to get up on the onto the tail end instead of trying to throw your leg over the side and capsize the thing again. That's my take on it anyway. What about this place? Especially now. We've got it to ourselves. We're not staying here. But um, we're back in at town. The Luang Prabang view. We were meant to stay here. But girls being girls want to go shopping and it's too far to head back into town. You're looking about 25k. I think you're going to do a synchronized jumping or something. Okay. No. Oh, this one's coming on the hmm? silly moment, did you? No, I just turned it on and missed it. I thought I couldn't get to it quick enough. And then you caught on. <laughs> Check out this feed. They've got forest. <laughs> How's that for getting looked after? Step off the boat, got a meal like this, and I did hear the word Heineken not long ago. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I understood that. They were just talking loud, but I was able to pick out Heineken. That's where we're set up at the moment. Yeah, they got a fire for us going on over here. We're going to have a feed and a few drinks here. Talking shit. Before heading back into town later on tonight. You had a good day? Yes. Are you going to tell me, translate that story to me later? What happened? Do you know what happened? But very long story. Yeah, very long story. Yeah. The gist of it is, story about this. think of how it's a vulture like walks on the ground with its head down low and its yeah. wings up high like that. Yeah. Well, it was this big, massive bird that was terrorizing the village here and killing people. So the, the word was put out for, for a hero to come and come and kill it. And a hero did come. I think he liked the mayor's daughter. That's why he came. That was the prize. Was that the prize, Nene? Mm -hmm. Whoever killed it won the mayor's daughter. Mm -hmm. Got to marry the mayor's daughter. I'm not sure. Uh, <laughs> Can't we be I'm not making that up. That's I, the. I, I know about that. Honey. Okay. So, what type of bird is this big one then? Parung. Parung. Okay. Is parung. Yeah. So the hero killed. Yeah. A, that type of bird, Palung. But this area now is called Pa An because of all the Pa An birds here. Okay. I think I got that. Once she gets 24, 32. Yeah. <laughs> All she needs is like papaya salad. <laughs> you hear that? Just voices just echoing throughout. Sounds like it's coming from up in these caves or on the other side of the hill, but I think it's just reverberating off from behind us. The houses, villages. Well, not houses. It's not much, not much over, the, over the other side of this hill. Oh. <laughs> now they've started. Put the beer, put the beers down. 
ดาเจ้าทินเจ้าทานมีได้ลูกหลานมามวนมาซื้อเด้อมาดีเด้อ